YouTube, Mark Kaufman here, and today I have a Tinker Small from Victorinox to show you. Now this one is missing its scales. This is one that I had to do a little bit of repair work on, and the scales are still in the mail, but this is a MacGyver Tinker Small. So for me, I've been starting to collect these because I... I have a feeling in a sense that these are going to become valuable and and worth a little bit of money and I'm talking maybe thirty forty dollars I'm not talking about hundreds of dollars but this one here I had to fix the blade on so it had a horrible bend in the blade and I tried to st straighten that blade out and it ended up snapping so this is a little bit of an advice video and a preview of this knife but when you have a bend in a Victorinox knife, um, I would probably go about it using a very uh, light hammer or, or, or something like that instead of bending it. Um, you can pound it back straight, but I would not try to bend it because I've had a lot of luck pounding it straight. But if you are bending these back to being straight, they usually snap. Almost 95% of the time they snap on my end. So just a little bit of advice. This one came out good. I mean, it's still a very usable blade. It's just going to be very short, but you still have a great knife here. You have very usable tools and it all has very nice snaps to it. And I just can't wait to get some scales on this and the pen blade's fine. You know, it's got a little bit of a bend there and I ended up just leaving that alone. But yeah, it's very usable. It's going to have some new scales coming in the mail for it. But this is just kind of a, a preview of this knife and um, just a little piece of advice regarding straightening out your blades. So till the next one, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.